Hello, this is Kristen. I am coming to you from the Cashmere Goat in Camden, Maine, and this is my first video that I am doing via YouTube. So, hi to anybody who hasn't happened upon me before. Um, I own the Cashmere Goat Yarn Store in Camden, Maine, and I do unboxing videos. I've had a few issues with the social media accounts, and I've decided to switch it up and do videos in a different way and then share them on my social media account. So if you don't have social media, you can now view these, which is awesome. And without further ado, I am going to be doing an unboxing from Malabrigo. I got a big box of Malabrigo today and uh, it's always fun to see what's in these. <laughs> Everybody likes a big box of yarn. So I have a very large box of Malabrigo here. And it is full of a few different types of yarn. We have been selling a lot of Rasta lately. Rasta is a single ply from Malabrigo. It's a big, super bulky for those of you unfamiliar. Um, it can make a hat in a very quick time. <laughs> Even if you're a new knitter, this is fast stuff. So, I have some new colors. This is called Soriano. S-O-R-I-A-N-O. Beautiful purples. Um, and some greens. It's a little bit of everything. Little bit of everything. Soriano. So once again, Rasta is super bulky. This is a 90 yard skein. It's 150 grams and it's typically knit on like a 13 or a 15. Some people go higher, some people go lower. It just depends upon you. Um I have two, I got the two bags. No, I got three bags of that new color. Uh and then I think this is also a new color for me. We never know what's going to be available to us from Malabrigo, so it's kind of fun. Sometimes it can be a little crazy. Ooh, this one is glorious. So pretty. So, so, so pretty. So that's called Oxido. And let me see what else I have. Rasta, here's another color. And I am cutting the bags because I heard that my um, ripping the bags open was a little loud. So I'm trying to make these videos better and better as I go. I'm always open to criticism. Uh, this is a glorious color. Also, this is called Boreal. We have had this before. Um, it's really, it is sort of Aurora Borealis, so it's called Boreal. I don't know if that's why it's called that, but that's what it makes me think of. Um, <laughs> oh, one of my personal faves, lettuce. Gotta love this color. I am a giant fan of green, and so... Are a lot of people. I love this shade of green. It's so good. So, so good. So that is lettuce. And, so, and then this one is called Baya, Baya Electrica. Pinky purple, super bright. And we haven't had this one in a bit. These are some, this one was new last year. Um, and it is called Campfire. This is a super fun one. This one reminds me of tie dye. Good, good colors. And this might be it. One more Rasta color, and it is called Garden Gate. This one's a little more subdued than the last few uh, we've been looking at. 
it look it's a little bit darker in person the lighting here once again I'm not quite used to it it's pretty it's very bright in this store um which is great but sometimes it renders a little different on video so that is called garden gate and then i believe i have um i got I received also some colors in Arroyo. Arroyo is a sport weight from Malabrigo. It is a beautiful plied yarn. It, it is, um, sorry, not sport weight. It is DK weight. It, it, I've seen it knit up in sport though. I'm not gonna lie, I've seen it knit up in sport, <clears throat> uh, in a sport pattern and it worked pretty well, so. Um, it is technically DK. This is, uh, 335 yards, 100 gram skein, and it is super wash. This color is called Immortal. Beautiful green. And this stuff just, it just, because of the plies and, uh, the hand dye and the smallness of it, it knits up just, it just looks beautiful. Um, this is called Wabi Sabi. This is a new one for us. Ooh, that is glorious. A little bit of teal, a little bit of green. I have not seen this one. This is, this is my jam. I love this. Really nice. some other shades in here so these are great skeins for making cowls for making hats for making shawls you could do the shift in this um, you could do a lot of things this color is called Wales Road beautiful purples and blues and it comes a little a little tealy there a little turquoise maybe beautiful beautiful colorway Wales Road and then this is called water green this is it seems like a solid but if you look at it it's got real subtle tonal color shifts which I love it makes it makes it so much fun to knit just different than doing a solid um, I think it makes it more fun myself. And we were definitely low on uh, of the, of the Arroyo yarn. So we got a lot of it today, which is awesome. This is called Lavanda. It's purplies with a little bit of brown. Another gorgeous colorway. It's so interesting to see these uh, colors on different bases. Yarn colors dyed the same way on different bases. It's a fascinating thing. It can be radically different. Um, so, we are, we love seeing how it's going to come out. And Malabrigo does this differently. Um, their dye process, because it's hand dyed, uh, Sometimes it can be radically different from one dye lot to another, or even sometimes within the same dye lot, which does offer challenges. Um, it makes for a unique product, which I like, but if you are making a sweater out of this, you want to alternate skeins. So this is Sarazza. It's a great red with some dark undertones. Really nice. And let's see. Really careful not to <laughs> cut the yarn in these bags. I went for a lot of purpley blues, I guess. This is called Purpurus. Once again, Arroyo, DK weight, 335 yards for a 100 gram ball. Beautiful pinks, purples, little gray kind of in there. All right. I think, oh, nope. The ever popular. Anniversario. 
everybody loves this colorway. It is full of all the colors. And this one in particular can look very different from skein to skein. So there's a lot going on there. People love this stuff. It is so fun. Lots of greens, pinks, purples, blues, a little yellow. And then sometimes like th here, this is from the same one. It's a, it seems a lot more green. So this is how it is. And when if you buy these online, we try to, you know, if you get two skeins, we get the ones that look the most alike to send them to you. We are, we are pretty careful with that. We understand we're knitters and we want you to be successful. So, let's see what else is in here. I think I got it all except for, oh, I wanted to show you this too. This is uh, Arroyo. This is Anniversario. So this is what this knits up like. This is like a little mini shawl. It's the super eyelet shawl. Um, and it took one skein of Arroyo. It's, it's pretty small. Um, it's a nice sample, but I'm not sure if it would stay on me very long. I guess I would put it like this, but I think it would quickly fall off. So I would, I would keep going if this was me and make it bigger, but it's a nice sample to show you what the yarn looks like. And it's very soft and squishy. Um, so I have one, I'm ordering more of this. It's on the way. Well, hopefully it will be on the way soon of, um, Mecha, which is, a uh, bulky Mal Malabrigo yarn. And this is a brand new, I only have one, um, one bag of Mecha, but this is a fun, fun new colorway. It's called Anamona. Anam Anamona. Okay. So, beautiful, beautiful stuff. Super soft. I have never seen this knit up. It is very pretty, though. And I wanted to go back. I The, the Rasta, if you are interested in any of the colors of Rasta, the bulky stuff that we started with, this stuff here. You gotta love Rasta. It is super soft. It, it knits up so quickly, and I do have some samples. Um, this is the Saturday Spiral hat, and I have a few samples of this. Um, this is a free cashmere goat pattern. If you want, buy the yarn, and you want this pattern, you put a note in the order or give us a call or send us an email and we will get you this pattern. It is free. Uh, it's called the Saturday Spiral Pattern. And then we have a simple hat pattern, which is also a free pattern. If you would like uh, just to make a plain one, I have the pattern for this. And then there is, this, this is very popular. Um, the, this is the Lotus Blossom Beanie, and it takes two different colors. You can make two hats out of them, and then they will be opposite, but and they look pretty different. So you basically want things that contrast a lot. Lotus Blossom Beanie has been super popular. It is available on Ravelry. You can purchase it through us, or you can just go online to Ravelry yourself and buy it. Um, but if you want any of these things, you can hop online, uh, cashmeregoatyarn.com, and we will have it there for you. Any questions, call the store, send us an email, or come on in. Thanks for watching.